Mustang PEK 3685 back here with a, I'm doing a quick video okay um, I've had a request from one of um, the viewers to show what the screen's like now I'm just going to go over this quickly the screen is an IPS screen so it is, it is very good viewing angles um, the colours are actually very good on it as well it's full 1080p 120Hz refresh rate um, it's 94% NTSC and it is also anti-glare. So, and what we mean by anti-glare is, I'll show you quickly, um, and then I'll do, I'll, 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 I'll tilt the lid at different angles to show you the viewing angles. I'm going to put my, my LED torch to the screen and I'll show you what this means. So... See up in the top left there, you're getting the this the kind of see it. Um, it's like it's like it's like it's the sun in the sky, right? That's the LED light shining directly onto this, right? So if I go below here, you will see. See what I'm saying? It's an anti-glare screen. So look at it. So say I put this LED light anywhere. Look at it. Um, you see it doesn't horribly bounce back or give a horribly terrible sharp light if you know what I'm saying like if the sun was directly on this screen so ideal if it's outside and I'm going to do another quick bit here just to show you so this is my um, 4k television and look at the difference this is this does not have glare see what I'm saying look at that there so instead of it being like a kind of dulled down yellow, because this is an LED light that's on my camera as well, very bright, the anti-glare dulls the light down, as you can see, because look at that. You can see the big massive shine on the screen, which is obviously not great. So great as well if you're outdoors um, and it's sunny. Um, the anti-glare screen means that you'll not get a horrible um, bright light like that coming back to your face, basically. So... Viewing angles. I'm going to tilt the lid and I'm going to show you. So this is me tilting the lid at the moment for you. Now, sorry about the shake, but it's just because I'm trying to do it while using my hands. So, see what I'm saying? It stays consistent. So you know how the older displays, the laptop lid needed to be tilted at certain angles for the most optimal um, colour or brightness? With this, it's fantastic, no matter where you tilt it. So say, I'll tilt this further back for you just to see it, show you it. So this is tilting it further back, as you'll see. I'll come out a bit just to let you see it. So that's it, further tilted back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm gonna tilt the lid up straight, okay? Now what I'm going to do is while I do this, I'm going to show you different angles. So this is obviously further away here. So there is the sort of, see what I'm saying, because it's an IPS. Um, so this is for one of the people that's watching because they were asked me to do a quick video so I'm just showing you so this is directly in front of it see what I'm saying again um, it maintains the colour um, and the brightness perfectly so even further back I mean look you can see further back I'm just going to refocus the camera here whenever it wants to refocus because the apples are a pain for that so let's just go to the left hand side here of the laptop ah oh, the iPad's been a pain right so see the angle here as well look so I'll come right to the side and you'll see it maintains the brightness and the color level okay so that was just a quick video just to show you um, the quality of the display and the colours um, and honestly it is a very good display on this laptop it's not a cheap display um, yeah so any other questions feel free to let us know um, but yeah I mean honestly I would hi highly recommend this gaming laptop I can't say it enough it is brilliant um, yeah so there you go, I hope that's helped you. Um, any other questions, let me know. Please give us a like and subscribe. And thank you for watching. I'll be back with more benchmarks soon.